there will not be a future without nuclear and without coal. Uh, maybe one, uh, yeah, maybe without coal and we do gas, but uh, without nuclear and without fossil fuels, there won't be a future in Germany for the time being. We had a compromise about nuclear power between all the social groups and then after Fukushima, Mrs. Merkel decided within one week uh, to uh, shut off the plants. And that was a rather spontaneous decision which was backed by the majority of the population at the time. But I wonder what will be this majority if uh, the implications become known to the people. Uh, until 2022 uh, these plants will be running and after that they won't be available and then we will have either more fossil fuel or we will have very volatile green electricity uh, with an unstable net. So there we have a problem which we have not yet solved. Uh, we have feed-in tariffs, uh, artificial prices for wind and solar, and then they have the priority right to go into the net. Uh, this all uh, requires a lot of money, and uh, the consumers have to pay for it. The consumers pay 23 billion euros per year more currently than uh, they would have had to pay without uh, these subsidies. Moving into wind and solar will be difficult uh, beyond a certain point because when the pikes of the wind and uh, solar energy production are more than demand, uh, then we cannot uh, smooth off the difference by cutting uh, on, sh on shutting off existing power plants. They cannot run in negative territory. Then we would have to have a storage device for the peaks, but there is hardly any uh, reasonable storage possibility available. I mean, there are possibilities. There's nuclear fusion, uh, which would be a different way of producing nuclear energy free of radiation uh, that we should look for. And Germany is actually advancing. Supposedly, um, the north of Germany will be filled with uh, wind energy, uh, new ones, and solar panels. This will still not provide enough energy for Germans' demand? Uh, the wind energy comes only from the north because the wind is twice as strong as in the south and that means uh, eight times as much energy for some square root formula which uh, uh, physics has given us. Uh, so we need to have power lines from the north to the south. These are expensive. Uh, there's a lot of local opposition but Germany will make them. The question is, is it so useful? Because uh, um, in the east and in the west there is uh, sufficient nuclear power supply and I think what will also happen is that the private net companies will try to uh, bring nuclear energy into Germany. Currently we are doing it through Austria, so the, uh, the Czech current electricity goes to uh, Austria, is whitewashed and then to sent to Germany and everyone has a good feeling. <laughs>